from 12.33, May 9th. So like I said, these guys control information, and they control information between people. So they may make people think that other people are aware of things that they aren't. They may make other people think other people know stuff that they don't. That's part of the control of information hustle. And they love to, and because they control information, they love to speak for other people. That's part of their tactic. Do not trust them. If you want to speak to someone, you speak to them directly in person. Do not trust intermediaries. The intermediaries are some of the criminals. The intermediaries are, intermediaries are the people misleading people and speaking for other people. That's probably why there's all this confusion is because people keep relying on intermediaries. That's part of their system of control, this control of information, these intermediaries. If someone wants to speak to me and ask me questions, talk to me directly in person. Don't rely on any intermediary. Don't rely on anyone who speaks for me. That's how they're controlling information between people. That's how they're misleading people. That's how they're peddling disinformation. They also like to peddle disinformation while an opposing party or opponent is not present. That's part of their control of information hustle. That's part of their perception manufacturing hustle. So you need to ponder and explore all the ways they're manipulating people with control of information and intermediaries. That will open your eyes to so much stuff it's scary. Because there's these kids who claim like I'm involved with them that I've never even met. There are people who claim I've seen some game I've never seen. And then they tell people this while I'm not present to be like, you're a fucking liar. And also so I don't know who's doing that so I can't just sue them. Because then I don't have evidence, I can't just operate off of telepathy and things tele people tell me via telepathy. Because these telepathy people have all sorts of impersonation hustles, imaging hustles, they have voice modulation hustles. They got all sorts of tactics for impersonation with telepathy. So they could say they're the Pope, but it doesn't mean they're the Pope. They could fire an image of the Pope at the BCI that I see in the mind's eye. That means it's the fucking Pope. So they have all sorts of impersonation tactics. They could ask people I know for familiar statements and sayings. Say a, fami a familiar statement to me and then um, uh, pretend to be that person. But it doesn't mean it's that person. So they have all sorts of hustles. But one of their key components of this, their system is this control of information, these intermediaries, this uh, d uh, peddling their disinformation uh, when the opponent's not present and controlling information between parties and then speaking for other people between parties because they control communications. And they use that to their advantage and they use it to manipulate. So if you're intelligent, you need to ponder everything I say on YouTube and say to you and then what contradicts it. And it's probably because it's a control of information hustle. It's an intermediary speaking for me who's controlling information and works for some criminal and he's carrying out their agendas. So ponder all the ways these, this control of information and these intermediaries are being used to manipulate people speak for other people, peddle disinformation, etc., etc. That's their, their key tool. Um, and that's how they're manipulating people. Uh, I wouldn't rely on intermediaries and I would not rely on their realm of controlled information where they all purposefully, they all purposefully deny me access to this realm because they don't want me to be present to see what they're saying and they don't want me to be present to say, you're a fucking liar. Uh, they also purposely don't want to talk to me in person and only communicate me with communicate me with communicate with me via telepathy, because they're lying about something and they're controlling communication for a reason. Partly it's because they're stealing my IP data, material content, raps, guitar songs. But another piece of this is um, that's how they manipulate people. They don't want me present. And then they also use telepathy because they can turn it on and off as convenient. So if you want to talk to me, talk to me in person, whoever you are, because I don't trust telepathy people. Never did. Uh, I talk to them here and there, but that's just because they're always around 24-7 telling me weird shit, and I try to put it together and analyze it, and then I report to fucking law enforcement because I don't fucking trust them. Yeah, I never go where they tell me to go. They told me to go to Google, Apple, Amazon, Facebook, all sorts of weird places. I don't go. They told me to go to Dallas, to buy I'm like, no, nah, I'm good on that. You want to talk to me, you talk to me in person. Yeah, fuck you and your covert shit, or whatever they're doing. Yeah, I don't trust people who are covert. When, if they're normal citizens, what do they need to be covert for? What illegal shit are they involved in? Yeah, key point. So, uh, yeah, what's all the need for all this covert shit? Why are they all covert? What the hell are these kids doing? That's really weird. So, um, uh, yeah, part of how they're manipulating people is their covert nature, their control of information, their intermediaries, and controlling crosstalk between people. And playing intermediary between people. Go directly to the person if you need to speak to them. And speak to them in person. Don't rely on their intermediaries. Don't rely on their tech. These guys are manipulators. And they use that to their advantage. Praise Jesus.